everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, in today's video, I'm filming something that I have wanted to film for a long time now. I constantly watch these on YouTube, like they're always on my suggested to watch. Um, so I thought I'd give one a go myself. So basically what I'm gonna be filming is a what I eat in a day student edition. Um, in all honesty, what I eat probably isn't that thrilling and it tends to stay sort of like the same throughout the week. Because I'm at university, because I have a busy life, it's just easier if I buy set things that I can have set meals throughout the week. Um, but yeah, I thought I would film one of these. Like I said, I've seen a lot of these floating around and two of my favourite people to watch of these videos is Velvet Ghost, obviously Gabby, um, and also Lucille. Um, I don't know if any of you are familiar with Lucille's videos, but I will link her channel below because her What I Eat In A Day is, they're, they're absolutely brilliant. She can literally eat for England and I so wish I had the metabolism to do that because I definitely don't. Um, anyway, I had great fun filming this. I hope you enjoy watching it. Without further ado, I'm going to jump straight on into the video. So my day tends to start at about quarter to six in the morning, which is very early, I know. I feel really quiet because my flatmates are still asleep. And also I've just woken up, which is why I look a rice day. The very first thing that I eat slash drink on most of my days is a cup of tea. I literally cannot start my days off without a cup of tea. So I'm just going to sit and sip on this. I always have the Yorkshire tea because let's face it, it's not really a cup of tea if it's anything else. Um, made with the half spoon sugar and green milk very exciting i'm sure you wanted to know that but that's the first thing i eat in my day so before i eat absolutely anything i am going to head to the gym i always train on an empty stomach i don't know if this is advised or not basically if i have breakfast before i train it will probably just come straight back up again um so i have my cup of tea and i'm going to head straight to the gym before i have anything else to eat and get a workout in <music> So I'm just out of the shower, back from the gym, had a good workout, obviously hence why I look like this, wet hair, no makeup, kind of red seal because I worked hard. Anyway, we're going to look past that. Um, it has just gone 8 o'clock I think and I'm absolutely starving so I'm going to go make myself some breakfast. I'm not entirely sure what I fancy today, whether I want porridge or granola. We'll see, we'll see what I feel when we get to the kitchen but let's go and get me some breakfast. So I went for my good old granola in the end. I basically just have around 40 grams of granola, which is about one third of a cup with nearly yogurt and an apple. Got my green tea and I've got my barocca going on here. I'm gonna prop you up and I'm gonna watch some YouTube and eat my breakfast because I'm blooming starving. I forgot to take the raisins out of my granola. I hate raisins. Always pick them out. I'm literally like a five year old, honestly. So it has just gone half past ten and I've made myself a little morning snack. My um Breakfast never keeps me going for that long, so um, normally like a couple of hours after I've had my breakfast, I tend to put myself a snack, and it's normally just fruit and a cup of tea. This is when you learn that I drink an embarrassing amount of tea throughout the day, so we're on cup number two. I have had one green, so that balances it out right. Anyway, I'm going to sit and munch on my banana. 
So, it has just gone at one o'clock, so I'm going to make myself some lunch. My lunch tends to be like the same most days. I'll probably have a salad of some sort. This week I have noodles, so I'm gonna make myself like a noodly, salady, stir fry type thing. I will prop you up, we can cook together. Little bake with me, but not bake with me. Instead, make salad with me kind of thing. Anyway, let's make me some food, because I'm gonna get grouchy in a minute, because I'm absolutely starving. <laughs> So the veg that I tend to have with my salad is red pepper, grated carrot and a crap ton of spinach because I like my greens. And just like that we have my big bowl of lunch house. Admittedly it's not the prettiest bowl of food but it tastes good so... Basically what I think I said was I was just explaining what I put into my salad. In that one today I have around 40 grams of noodles-ish. Um, with spinach, red pepper, carrot, um, and then sweet chilli chicken on top and then I've also got like a sweet chilli salad dressing in it as well just to give it a bit of flavour. So that is my healthy lunch. That was absolutely yeah, delish. And part and part of being a student, I don't know if I'm just making up excuses, I probably am, is treating yourself when you've done work. So I've just popped to Costa and got myself a hot chocolate. Little coffee break, although it's not coffee because I still have the taste buds of a five year old. So hot chocolate is. It's just the new bonfire spice latte actually. I tried it the other day and I'm trying to figure out if I like it or not. Like I think I do, but it's very sweet. So that is like my afternoon snack afternoon treat because i needed it to keep me going from work if i'm completely honest with you so guys it is currently it's nearly half past six um it's been a while since i've eaten actually i had lunch at like one so i'm starting to get very hungry i'm gonna head off into the kitchen and make myself some dinner i'm probably gonna have pasta that is no shock but we'll see what i'm feeling when i get in there of course i will take you guys along with me in there and we can cook together yeah let's cook <laughs> five points to you if you've got the breaking bad reference we love that and veg in the end that's shot underneath all of this cheese as well it is low fat cheese so it's all right and then i've also got my corn chicken nuggets with it to make it a bit more substantial than just pasta and veg um so i'm gonna sit and watch some netflix and eat my dinner i'm done with boys <laughs> Full on done to like do deep breathing to not scream right now you need to get over this Marshawn Lynch situation. guys it has been a couple of hours since i've had my dinner i'm sitting in exactly the same spot in my dressing gown and catching up on some netflix and my last sort of like thing food of the day is my final cup of tea i think this may be my third cup of tea of the day um i have a problem i probably need help but you know let's not talk about that and then i also have a couple of digestive biscuits next to me because i like my biscuits i low-key have to restrain myself from eating the entire pack of digestive biscuits when i eat them um i literally have to take two out of the packet and put it away quickly so i can't be like tempted to to eat more but yeah that will be the last thing that i eat tonight so that concludes my 
like what I eat in a day, finishing it off with a cup of tea, shock, I definitely have a problem. I didn't realise how much tea I drank until I watched this back and I was like, whoa, Han, you need to chill on the whole tea thing. I had great fun filming it. I actually really enjoyed like just vlogging about what I eat and stuff like that. I think it's going to be really interesting to look back on like in a year or so and see if I'm still eating the same sorts of things because I tend to be very set in my ways of what I eat. Like I like to eat the same thing every single day. Unless I'm like going out for food, I've got my parents visiting me or friends visiting me. Um, I do tend to stick to the same sorts of things. So like I say, it will be interesting to see this time next year if I'm still living off noodles and pasta. But for the time being, that is my current like diet, student diet, on a student budget, obviously. Um, but I hope you have enjoyed it. If you are new to my channel, please do make sure you subscribe, give it a thumbs up and all of that fun stuff. And yeah, I hope to see you all in my next video.